So guys, there is Bad Segenton talking to you and today we're going to play some Team Fortress 2. From the beginning I have to show you my new HUD. It's called the Bad HUD as you can see right here in the top of the screen and it's a nice HUD, you know, I liked it and you also will have a link in the description where you can download this HUD and uh, it's quite simple you know <clears throat> now uh, I'm just going to present my HUD a little then I'm going to show you how to install this HUD this HUD is not made my, by me I didn't ever work to this HUD so if there is a guy named Bud or I'm going to search, research, do some research and see if there is some, somebody called Bud who made this HUD, I will le leave his links in the description if he has a channel or a Facebook page or a Steam group, so we're going to see. What I like as this HUD is you see this uh, there where it uh, says loading retrieving server info these colors that are shining you know it's like an interactive HUD and uh, I like it you know it's not simple it's more complex and um, I have to tell you something, you can um, find me on, on casual or on community servers by name Bad Segenton and if you want to play together you can send me a friend request or join my team group because I have a team group and uh, let's choose to be a medic so as you can see, the chat is in the left side of the screen. Um, taunting, you know, there are some uh, the Uber charge matter. There is might be a spy, I don't know. No, it's not a spy. The orbit charge matter is uh, here. In the where is the little scout? Okay, I'm sorry. So you can see the Uber charge in the middle of the screen. So this can give you additional information about how much did you heal your. No, I'm sorry, how... I don't know how to express myself. Oof, I don't know, dude. Just, you can see. <laughs> you can see the Uber charge here. And uh, I'm just going to wait for me to die. And then I'm going to search for... Oh, shit. Okay. Now let's go for... Spy because uh, it's my favorite class and I want to present you how it, it looks like okay so as you can see you have in middle knife and cloak let's start with this a little okay in the middle you have the knife because I have uh, my uh, spicicle in the loadout so you know when a pyro shoots at you that you oops oh, it's a friendly pyro when a pyro is shooting at you you can uh, you can stop the flames using the bicycle and uh, 
Oh, I'm sorry. I just stopped. Okay, uh, so in the middle also you can see the... Oops, okay, I see him. You can see the cloak. In the left side you have where we are being disguised. You have the life and information of your enemy that you are disguised as. So uh, it's nice, you know. Let's see if we can take this. Okay, I took him. Okay. And uh, that's all. Just here you have a nice uh, loadout where you can see how your character looks as a blue. I don't know why, why it's not working right now. Have some problems. Here are the towns and there is the loadout. You're you're going to see the backpack like this. Okay. And uh, that's all I can present you know. So um, I'm going to go one more time. As in, no, I'm going to be on soldier. I don't know how. I... Damn. Oh, okay. There was a little ping because I didn't die from the first shot, and uh, that's all with the HUD. So uh, now I'm going to show you how to install this HUD. So uh, I'll be right back. So now I'm going to show you how to install the HUD. You just go to Mozilla Firefox or any browser you have but first you have to uh, have your game closed type in here huds.tf and you're going to the first site you have you're going to have the link in the description so check the description below now we're going to the HUD directory section and you can see right here a lot of HUDs I'm going to go directly to the bot HUD and there you can see the some screenshots from the game using the, that HUD so what I'm going to tell you is that you can use this tutorial for any other HUD if you like I don't know a HUD or Isaac HUD you're just going to do the same things that I'm doing right now so just going to view HUD scroll a little in down and here you're going to have download you just click this big green button where it writes download 3.88 megabytes click on it save the file and now I'm going to open it we're just going to your downloads folder and open this zip file. Here we're going to have the bad hard master folder. I'm going to close my browser. I'm just going to press here extract to go to desktop, double click and type OK. Now we're going to wait a little. OK, it's done. And here we're going to have bad hard master. Now you're going you're going to reach the main Steam folder. You can have it located here in C D A E. I don't know how your hard disk drives are named, but I have placed it in the I just go to Steam Library, Steam Apps common 
and there you can see your games or the downloaded programs from the Steam. Double click Team Fortress 2, go to TF folder, and here you're going to see this custom folder. Double click on it, and if you're done well, you're going to see here readme.txt, but I don't know it's, if it's really important and workshop here now we're going to double click this folder pathad master what i downloaded and here we can see a, i'm going to wait good here we can see a subfolder named pathad we we'll just click on it right click copy going to this custom folder right click here and press paste as you can see it's uh, it copied right here you can close this you can delete the folder and um, that's all now you can you can play with your HUD and that's all the tutorial so thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe, leave a like if you enjoyed what I have done and you appreciate my help. You can leave me a comment with what I can improve at my channel. So that's all I can have to, that's all I can tell you. So see you guys next time.